some friendly fire in juice there to take that can't exit back out through here just double checking there wasn't anything further up I don't think so. I feel like we don't have enough time to pull on that thing, but... Apparently we do. Hopefully that's number three. Okay, at least we're still on track with that. Someone else stuck over there. Let's see if we can help. Uh, again, just misjudged jumps. It doesn't happen to... Oh my god, they saw you all the way back here. That's rude. But I don't need to do any of this again, I guess. Just take your time. Just make sure you kill them. Make sure life is Oh, I didn't hold it down long enough. I kind of quick tapped it. But you have to hold it down for long enough. Yeah. That's my mistake. Okay. Let's go, buddy. This one's like a double. Oh, no. I underestimated that. Okay. I'll join you guys at that one. Yeah, with this one, I don't think you need to rush it as much as you think you do. Just let it actually get up there. Sometimes you try and just move too fast and you do it while it's still turning and shit like that. It's just it's not necessary. But that one's difficult because I can't get there with like a single thing. Come on, look how close I was. This is one of the rare times when they're being harsh with the checkpoints. Look at this. I have to do all of that work again. And the, the only reason I complain about it is because it's just not been that kind of game. Like, if the game had trained you that this is just how it works, it's just that kind of brutal game, then it's like, yeah, okay. But I'm just not used to it with this one. Might see if the, it's better to go to... There isn't a checkpoint here either. Whoa, for real? That's rough. Yeah, that last one's going to be a little bit of a challenge. This one again, I think just wait until it actually turns. But this one, I think you kind of have to ride the cube here. There we go. Ah, yes, it's Journey. What a great little game. Desert Wanderer. Great at making things. Yeah, excellent game. Very, very short, uh, but beautiful. Always recommend. Anyone on uh, Sony should definitely try that game. I do have a playthrough of it on the channel. I did it offline, which I kind of later regretted, but... Um, oh my god. But definitely play it. 
and do play it online. Don't don't be don't be silly like me. Oh, oh you get the that's so annoying, I could have had it all along. We don't have to like bonk them on the head or anything. Let's see what we've got here. Hmm. Which is the correct way forward? Let's do this bit first then. This level doesn't have a portal, so let's just get down there. I think it's just another character we can find. Ooh. Let's go, buddy. Yeah, I thought this one was going to be about the time stopping mechanic, but I'm glad that we have basically like a, a new one instead. They haven't really rotated, uh, sorry, repeated it too much, which I think has been really nice. This isn't going to be around for a very long time, I have a feeling. That's another jigsaw piece, yeah. I'm really hoping now that the first one is uh, right at the start of the level when you're on the spaceship. But if not, it must be very close anyway. But it's going to be one of the two. Right, two more robos to find. Right back, outside. Good start. As soon as that first punch missed, I was like, yep, you were gonna die. I should have just done this. Like, there's a right way to do things, and sometimes just deliberately don't do it. How has this guy survived all of this? I've, I've lasered like 500 times. What on earth? Get out of here. Right. So. We flip this over, I guess. Yeah. Behind it. Give it the old spin to win. Flips back. I just put a foot wrong there. I love a good photo op. Cool, let's continue on. Oh, I see. Yep, almost missed it. There he is. There you are. Okay. Keeps us on track. Oh, come on. Let's just wait for it to flip back. How? Why did that not work? That's a little bit fiddly, but okay. Now the question is, where is the final bot? But how about this for a shot? Look at this. That looks so epic. So we have one left, but we'll have to see. Really hoping we find it here. Really nice level once again. I can hear something.
But sometimes I can't tell if they're just squeals from like the other MP, like the other beings here, or if uh, it's one of my. Ah, uh, there you go. Okay, perfect. There's my answer. I was looking down at these guys, seeing if he was kind of scattered among them, but. There we go. Perfect. Now we can end the level. Nope. No, we can't. Gotta time this a little better. There we go. Yeah, I do have a sneaky suspicion it was literally on that spaceship bit right at the start. Alright, I'm gonna get this one this time. Come on. Damn you. Tricked me. They get increasingly hard. I haven't got one in ages. Alright, quick dive back in. The serpent's gonna have to wait just a minute here. Okay. Here we go. Oh, uh, I think I saw something there. I think it was there, no? It was like semi-buried in the sand. I saw something sparkling, so I think it was there. Okay, so this time, if it's not to do with the left or right, like as in, if it seems too far left or right, it's to do with the boost, and so we knock this guy out. There we go. And then I think we can literally leave the planet now. Yeah, okay. And that should be that. Cool. Let's wrap up this next world by smashing this lock. And see if we can defeat the next boss. And then we've got to go back to the crash site to see what's new. So we head deeper, I think, into the second half of this game once we're done with this. Let's go. I wonder if they're going to borrow a little bit from Sekiro here. <laughs> Having to fight a giant serpent. Teaching a little bit of probably what you have to do. What do we got? Okay. Chicken heads back. <laughs> Just lay the egg. Let's see. Start. 
Whoa, okay, things are definitely getting a bit more difficult here. I'm just not seeing the window for damage. Yeah, so this is what they taught you early on. There you go. Just very good level design once again. Okay, the arena's smaller now. Ouch. Do you lose all your... Okay. Lies left though. There it is. I don't think I'm going to make it through now, but we'll see. Wow. Holy sh. What is happening? This is intense. Oh, yeah. I guess we did it. <laughs> there he is. The man. The myth. The legend. He's definitely one of the coolest looking ones so far. Nathaniel Drake. God, I miss Uncharted games, I really do. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Yeah, I thought there was going to be one more long stage. That's why I thought I'm definitely going to die on the last one. But thankfully we made it. Now, does this reveal another level again? It does, okay. So I assume this is going to be the Drake-themed one. I'm very much looking forward to this. Dude raiding. Okay. Yeah, whenever we've had something much more thematic to like a famous uh, Sony title, it's been really, really good. For now, at least, this is the closest we're going to get to playing a new Uncharted game. <laughs> and already, it looks very promising. We get to it. That's so dope. <laughs> the amount of different mechanics they've utilized here, and they've made them all work successfully. It's so much fun. Like they've kind of found a way to reduce them to like their most purest fun form without making them too overwhelming. Or like difficult to adjust to or anything. It's always just very intuitive and fun. He's got his PS Vita. Oh man, I miss my PS Vita. I really do. I'm so sad that I lost it. I love my Steam Deck, but the PS Vita is still, in terms of its sheer like size, for me it's still the best hand, one of the best handhelds of all time. Like what it could do in such a small package, is pretty much almost still unrivaled to this day. See that little? Okay, let's go this way. But yeah, I recently watched uh, my girlfriend play through a lot of the Uncharted collection. So she did a run of uh, 1 to 4. She'd never played some of them before. And it was just so nostalgic. We haven't had an Uncharted game since 2018. It's just been too long. 
Like, reboot the franchise, start it over, find, like, a new protagonist, do whatever you want to do. Like, I still think um, having Drake's daughter... Whoops, I, I was trying to shoot Val. <laughs> having Drake's daughter from the end of uh, Uncharted 4, I think, would have been the perfect place to continue. Maybe they'll do that, maybe they won't, but we'll just have to see. Alright, okay. Take it easy. There she is. Yeah, we're going to get the whole squad here. Looting Virtuoso knows you love to see her leave. <laughs> oh my god, that's brilliant. Uh, I was always Team Elena overall, but she's great too. Yeah, I was, I was busy remembering her leaving. That's what happened there. Oh. <laughs> Just want to double check. Uh, yeah, that was a whole detour that we completed. Yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing Sully. Sully's the man. I still think <laughs> it's a line that, that, that like, just springs to mind so often for me. Like, one of my favorite Uncharted lines of all time is still, I think it's from the very first game, um, where Drake and Sully are exploring together, and Sully says something about the good old days. And the way the way Nate, aka Nolan North, delivers uh, the next line is so good. He just, he literally, all he does is he just says, when were those again? Uh, the way he says it in that context, I just, I always remember that line. So whenever I hear something about good old days or something like that, I always say like, when were those again? <laughs> it's just too good. Hmm. So how do we get over to that side? Really nice music here though. I think maybe there's a way to backtrack it possibly. Let's start with this. There we go. Whoa. There's the man. Mustachioed mentor, doing the best with the hand they've, they've been dealt. I love Sully. Absolute legend. <laughs> Ooh. More goons. Yeah, great level again so far. I think that might continue the level though. We still have a missing jigsaw piece, I'm just... Yeah, I think that continues the level. I don't know if you can backtrack from there, so hold on. Let's not do that just yet. Although I might already be a bit stuck, no? Yeah, I want to take another look at this. How do we get through this part? I think there's a... Ch we can make this. This is a Nathan Drake jump. It would have been extremely hilarious if, let's say, for this particular level, they gave Astro like more jumping range because it's Nathan Drake. And he's famous for being able to, to make these ridiculous jumps. But, that said, where do we go from here? You can't leave without it, man. And that's why these games, like, they just have to, in that sense, they have to be well designed because they know the player but the majority of players are going to see anything they see, they've got to get it. And so we need to... We need to make it work. Now... Can we just shoot it? Oh, it's a pu... Basically seeing this, so much of this type of puzzle has been like, you can jump in from the top. Like, I thought this was a way in and stuff like that. It's a puzzle. I love it. Well, mini puzzle. There you go. <laughs> That's my bad. I, I didn't understand the assignment there. I think that's that's ultimately good. I just I didn't get it. That's fair. Okay, now we can move on. Right? Yeah. For God's sake. Okay, it's another one. Um, I assume we can... 
There we go. No nonsense, Merc. Friend to the elephants. I love this little. Oh. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah. Keep going. Are we going to find Charlie? I guess there's some like extra treasures to find as well in this one. Got the Jeep over there as well. Just such great design again. I mean, so much like unused parts of the level are still there because they wanted to really look the part and feel good. Take cover. Oh, man. I underestimate how many of them there still were. I thought I killed more of them by that point. Wow. And some of the projectiles are so slow. <laughs> wow. Okay. Four turtles. They're stuck underneath. Let's see if there's anything else here. Three more heroes to find. I've died more than I should have on this level, but I blame myself for basically all of it. Another one up there, Elena. Gotta rescue Elena and this red submarine as well. This rusty, very rusty submarine. Definitely brings back memories. That's my girl. Yes, four, four. Tenacious reporter, more valuable than any treasure. Hold, hold some stuff. Holy, oh, I thought I could get behind that. It's close. They've not made it, like, super easy or anything. Got to be patient. <laughs> I guess they're going to leave Sam uh, for a little bit later. deliberately make a pit stop here. Cool. I assume... Oh, okay. I thought I was making a pit stop here. Like, the bird looked like it just wanted to continue. But it's not. Wow. So they've even thrown in a few little puzzles here as well. You've got to love it, man. They're giving you the proper Uncharted experience. Yeah, I wasn't sure if that's what you needed to do. It's, of course, the opposite of what I tried to do. <laughs> I do have the third Jigsaw too. I don't know if uh, if I'm still on track. For now, I have been, but I feel like at this stage it's probably a bit too late anyway. If I've missed something. But ever since I started really focusing in on making sure I get everything with a pretty high percentage, I've been completing levels, having done everything. Like the last one was a bit of an exception, but that one I literally wasn't looking at the screen during the intro spaceship stuff. So I don't think it's that. 
doesn't really count in my book. Okay, going to trust in the fact that I've got everything and move on. Uh, oh, wow. There it is. Whew. How are we getting out of here? It's not that. Okay, I see it. So we have two more to find here. <laughs> Sounds man. Before that, yeah, I had a feeling there might be a little more. I think there was one more level where they did this. Let's see. Yes, okay, good. False ancestor. Nathan, never heard of him. <laughs> so we found Sir Francis Drake himself. There you go. Sam's in trouble once again. What a surprise. Oh. I was so close, like, behind the corner. Yeah, some of these shooting sections are a little bit, like, you have to be careful. All right, bro. Come here. Let's see the description for this. Prodigal brother. Treasure hunting runs in the family. Okay, there we go. We did it all. Oh god, yeah. It wouldn't be an uncharted level without some of this. <laughs> I think I'm going to die here. <laughs> it's just so good. Uh, okay, let's do that. <laughs> Shit. Shit. Oh, man. I wasn't sure whether to shoot or jump there. This little bit is... Uh, I wanted to rotate the camera like so I had that a better view, but... There we go. <laughs> Woo. GG. Excellent level once again. I mean, these like uh, thematic levels, they've just been so good. Let's just climb this first, I guess. Whoa. Okay. I have no idea what I'm doing. I was going to slide down. That all happened too fast. I was trying to track what to actually do with this. <laughs> Before I knew it, I died. So I think it's just kind of sliding down and up. I thought I was the one making it roll. Like I was pushing my analog stick to make it roll. And when it did, I thought I had to control the roll as well. Yeah, I need to see if uh, it does like the sliding by itself. I was pushing my analog stick. I thought I had to control how it slid. 
Yeah, it's doing it itself. Okay, fine. That makes more sense now. So all I do is control my up and down motion. I think starting high and then uh, sliding down is quicker, like he climbs more slowly. We must be close now. Yeah. <laughs> Woo. And there is our third major piece. Mothership's GPU accelerates, renders, process, and most importantly, sinks. Whew. Thank you, Nathan Drake. And thank you, Uncharted. Still one of my favorite franchises of all time. 